Hello Libra. Thank you for clicking on my channel and welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. This is your Zodiac Tarot forecast for the week ahead or whenever you clicked on the title at the time it intrigued you. And this is why I've put it together a playlist for you. Um, do check it out on my channel and see what resonates there for you. At the very head of your reading for this this particular reading we have the two of water. This is a soulmate. Spiritual union. Eight of air. Feeling stuck. Heart of your reading. The hangman. Boy, are you ever stuck? And withdrawn. Spiritual healing. Maybe physical healing. Maybe feeling a little bit trapped because of our, our, you know, global situation and most places being in lockdown. But what we do have is the lovers here. So we've got soulmate, true love. We have the hierophant, which is, well, the high priest. The dude that marries you. This is about something that is deep and meaningful. And there's nurturing. So we, I see Taurus, Capricorn, Gemini, Pisces, water is here. Uh, air is here as well. This nurturing, now this could be a mother, a sister, uh, you know, someone who is a relative of yours that's helpful. Um, this could be just someone who is very nurturing and loving. This could be you taking on this energy. This is also about meeting somebody that helps or someone who has the knack for making things beautiful. So maybe being beside the lovers, we've got you uh, uh, this love that is blooms into something very meaningful and beautiful. So at the head of your reading, we have these, the, that spiritual union, the soulmate and the lovers here. And in the middle, the hangman, this is where, you know, spirit says, hold up Libra. You need to look at things in a different perspective or a different way than you've been looking at them. You've been feeling stuck. And it's because of, um, you know, it could be a problem-solving thing. It's like I used to say in the old days when I was teaching people about computers, when they got frustrated, the real magic was step away from the computer. Because when you go back, the solution comes to you. So this is you stepping away from a situation to gain clarity love begins well well if this isn't a new love coming in your life it is the rebirth of a current love your uh, situation you're in intuition feeling stuck spirit wants you to follow your intuition also this would indicate that certain things have to take place an event uh, before something is revealed to you now, in this visual, look at, I know that's probably depicting some type of, you know, looking into the galaxy, looking into a mirror, or looking into a, looks like a UFO to me, just saying. Moving on. Maybe, Libra, you're too hung up on an issue that you need to move on from. <laughs> withdrawing is someone trying to bring you out of a shell and you need to be alone for a little wee while stand your ground get your boundaries healthy boundaries in place you know for one or two of you this may be moving on from an old relationship that or moving on from the 
effects of an old relationship in order to clear the path for this one. Mental conflict. You want something more meaningful. So whatever this decision is that you need to make, is that tug of war between uh, logic and emotion. Balance. You guys, some of you are dealing with a twin flame. Look at that. We've got the pillars here. And we've got the number 11. Finding balance. You know, the lovers as well is about divine timing and divinely guided for that right moment. But with balance being here, strong Libra energy. Perhaps it's, it is about, you know, looking into that mirror or looking into the looking glass of, of the cosmos to help you see something, to help you decide something and come to your balance, discontent, boredom. Some of you don't want to be nurtured. It's like, okay, okay, stop fussing over me. Discontent and boredom. This feels like some of you are separated from someone you want to be with for reasons that can't be helped. And so, uh, something has to take place, you know, like that. Uh, fulfilling some type of contract before. And it's just tedious for you, but it has to be done. And if you jump ship now, because you miss somebody, you know, Libra, I'm compelled to pull out another deck here. What does this mean? What is Libra discontent about? What does Libra need to do? Ten of Pentacles. You need to honor honor family stay focused on legacy stay focused on the task you will have it all you will uh, gain it all you do have someone coming in to help this is about distraction. You need to nurture something. It's almost like some of you here need to complete something. But we have emotional fulfillment. The nurturing. Try not to be distracted from whatever this job is you have to do. Because in the end you get both the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. Let's get some advice for love. a message or advice for Libra regarding love. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Finances and career are affecting your love life right now, but trust that the situation is calling for you to have faith. Your love life is being affected by children. That could be why the Ten of Pentacles came up. You just don't want to be separated from the one that you love. You want to be with them. But I think this is about putting those priorities in place. I hope that helped, Libra. And I hope you join me Sunday night when I go live to pull free cards for the party in the chat. Everything's in the description below. Thanks for joining me. God bless.
Bye-bye for now.